poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the gentle, for they shall inherit the earth. Just by being here, civilians and service members alike, you are showing your appreciation and compassion for what firefighters, paramedics, and police officers go through each and every day to keep us safe. So many of today's first emergency responders are too young to remember the events of that horrific morning. So I thank those of you who pass along the stories and its impact. And I thank the younger generation for taking the time to learn about this devastating attack and gain an appreciation for why it's so important to forever remember the individuals we lost. And serves as a reminder for, to all of us to share gratitude with our public safety members who put their lives on the line 24-7, 365 days a year. Thank you for allowing us to participate in this ceremony today. And thank you for all that you do to keep the memory alive today and every day so that our nation will never forget. We must learn from that day to truly overcome adversity. I urge all of you today to hug, handshake, high five a first responder, a firefighter. Thank the soldiers that were wounded in Iraq and Afghanistan. My own brothers and sisters, some of them didn't get to come home. Thank the men and women that put their lives on the line every single day so that we may practice freedom like we are right now. We must always remember that the greatest casualty is being forgotten. Firefighter Gerard Baptiste, Firefighter John Tierney, Firefighter Jeffrey Waltz. Michael F. Judge, Chaplain. Battalion Chief John Moran, Battalion 49. Members from Ladder 16, Lieutenant Raymond E. Murphy. Lieutenant Andrew J. Desperito, Engine 1. Fire Marshal Ronald P. Buka, Manhattan Base. I'm here to honor and remember Captain Jason Dahl, Captain of Flight 93, that went down in Shanksville, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania, from uh, he was living in Wilson, Colorado. James Michael Gray, Firefighter Sean S. Canley. Firefighter David LaForge. Let us all celebrate an unwavering commitment to the value of human life. Father, we also remember on this day all who perished at the Pentagon and in Pennsylvania. Father, we know that the innocents who left their earthly home on 9-11 have joined you in their true eternal residence in heaven.